way. Are you stuck? He's, he's not stuck. He didn't like the race. He didn't like the bells. I'm just trying to understand what the- It has fire. What are you doing? What are you doing? What is- what was that? Did you shit yourself? I'm alive. I was apparently not hit by that. Ow. Smack it. Keep smacking. Smacking is bad. Smacking is- is not working. Okay. I mean, I- look. I- okay. Okay. All of that work and he's at half health. Um, this is a really bad time to have to pee. I just want to know what you are. You're not, it's not a boss. Take my bells. Take my bells. Oh shit, that doesn't give me FP back. That's right. I just wasted a heal. Hi. You good? Can I keep doing this? This is okay? Yeah? Alright. Oh, okay, he's mad now. No, okay, he's mad. No longer appreciates it. Alerts, it's uh, people defeating shard bearing bosses in, in a group. I'm okay with this. I don't, I don't mind doing it this way. I bear no shame in this. Just sit still. Can you, can you sit still? No, I said sit still. Please? Yeah, right there. No, stay, stay. Good boy. He's got a cute little screech, doesn't he? Hit them in the head. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Yeah. Right in the moneymaker. Yep. This is fine. This is fine. I don't- I don't feel bad about this. I have to pee! Can you hurry up? I gotta pee! This is a fair fight, 100%. I am lactose, so I can't cheese. There we go. There we 
There we go. Yeah. I did it. He dropped a golden seed? I'm sorry? I haven't seen one of those in so long. Shit. Now we're gonna have a problem if you respawn. Golden seed? Let's go. Golden arrow. Smith thing stone six. Gotcha, bitch. Jesus fuck. Boss lady. Why are you like this? Why? Did you not see what I was just having to deal with? I'm stressed out enough. <laughs> Thank you very much for the, the six bucks. Eh. Dead end. It's all a dead end. Okay. If anybody asks, I did not cheese that thing. It's just the castle's trusty pet uh, tree worm. Kind of had tree branches sticking out of it, right? Maybe it's something from the Erd tree. That's why it was here. Maybe. You fell asleep in your chair? Well, at least your chair is comfy, right? Mm. Gotcha, bitch! Oh my She's not, in fact, the only one like this. Mew ha 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 ha. Bunch of shitheads. All of you. You're a bunch of shitheads. <laughs> Thank you for the six bucks as well, Warmonger. I appreciate it. You're still a shithead, though. Okay, I'm gonna go back to my side of grace. So we can go in the sewer area. I'm assuming sewer down there area. The poopy area with the rats. I'm gonna sit here first. And I'm gonna go to the bathroom because I gotta do the pee thing. So I'll be back in just a sec. Everybody be good. Listen to the mods. I'll be back in just a bit. Fucking alien! Where?
There's no shame in telling me who it was. Can you point me towards the offender? If you can point me in their direction, I'd appreciate it. I'm just innocent going to get some fruit snacks. And that's what you do? Is rub them. <sighs> Tweak. There we go. I thought my stream deck wasn't working for a second there. Thank you for the 350 bits. Thank you for the two get the subs. Two? Two. You're pain in the ass, though. My internet's pooping. Hold on. I'm back. <laughs> Boss lady, now behave. Yeah. Alright. Oh, we're gonna get back to it. Yeah, I got fruit snacks. How you doing, by the way? Tweak, how are things? Fart training coming? Please no. God, no. Hawkeye, shut up. Ah, <laughs> huh, Ev Mom. Ev Mom found Jeepers Creepers on TV, so she's watching that right now. Justin Long looking real young. Okay. We're back at it. If that thing respawns, I'm going to be real annoyed. I have three seeds. I need five. To give myself a new charge on my flask. Oh, this fucker respawns. Great. Um. I'm just going to go this way, ma'am. Actually, what am I doing? I should level. Look at my damn runes. Level. That's a better idea. Let's go health. Put a little bit into health. I do a good amount of damage. Um, actually, I have 10k left over. Let's... Actually, I figured out a trick. I should... Let's... Round table hold. And we can upgrade. You know, actually... Wait, has anything changed here? Besides everybody I've murdered? Mm. I still haven't duplicated... Radon... Uh, yeah, Radon's... Done getting that out of your system, Riblem. Swear to God. Thank you for 10 gifted subs. Holy shit. Thank you so much. But uh, can you not? Also, apparently this guy, this boss that we beat up with our, with our jellyfish the other day. Apparently he, I can buy his, his gear. Didn't know that. It was quite long. Ah. That's what she said. <laughs> Sorry. Decided to try playing Dark Souls right before Elden Ring came out. Uh, partly because of you talking about it a lot in Donnie's chat. Yeah, I have a... I have a hard time shutting up about these games. Because there's... There's some of my favorites. Like, legit. It's up there with favorite franchises of all time. With, like, as... Like, with Resident Evil. Boogity, 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 boogity. Damn it, Rubalem. Um... But I hope you're having fun with Dark Souls. Hope it treated you well. And if you're playing this, then, uh, good luck. Because this game is treating me like a piece of shit. <laughs> right now? <laughs> Thank you for the bitch, dragon. Stop it! Stop it! Battered iron from foreign land worn by Elmer Glue of the Briar. The winding rustern, rusted iron briars are a mark of the guilty and typically indicate a sentence of death. 
Elmer Glue murdered uh, numerous instructors and merchants and, and was known as the Bell Bearing Hunter. It's got a cape. Also, dude, Radon's gear is so fucking heavy. Like, look, okay. Queen's robe, five pounds, 5.1. Briar armor, 11.9, a little tankier. Radon, 17 and a half. Jesus! Good God! His hat, though. I feel like everybody wears that hat. I want his bow, though. I need to go duplicate it so I can get the bow. He was a very big dude, yeah. He was a big dude. Okay. Um, I guess just quickly make sure everyone's doing okay. No, 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 no. I need to do better than this. This will never kill a god. I can do better than this. It needs to slay a bloody god. You all right, buddy? Oh, it's you. Don't pay me any mind. It's not important. Just lay out your arms. No dialogue options. Hmm. Jeez. Hope you're all right, man. And then... The Feli was down here. In this ash. Oh, right. Okay. Um, I did something by accident because I was playing offline yesterday. And I was going to do that thing I told you guys about the other day with the, the, the quest line that uh, with, that involves doing three invasions and leaving. Uh, three invasions did that. And I ended up, I got to, when I did one invasion, I ended up in uh, that beginning area, the whatever of anticipation. And I saw that there was like a way to go up in the beginning area. So I went back and went up and found a chest. Um, and it had two things. One was this, Stormhawk Dean. So I have, <laughs> I have a bird summon. And then another one that was like ashes and it was a bird, but it was like the king of Love you, hawks or something. Lady. And, uh, but it said that I couldn't use it. Like it just, it would not listen to any master kind of thing. <laughs> Thank you. So that happened. Then I was coming back here and I was just talking to people to see if anything changed. And I talked to her and it gave me the prompt to give her that Stormhawk King thing. And it did. I, I gave it to her. And now she says, In this ash, I can smell the ancient storm. It reminds me of my first hawk. See? And she thanked me. But that was it. But now that's her dialogue. Alicia, thank you for the 30 months of Prime, by the way. I appreciate it. I love you, too. And thank you for gifting out a sub to the granny. <laughs> I appreciate it. Thank you. But, yeah. I gave her a bird. Went from stopping right after Taurus Steven to completing all the achievements, so I would say I'm enjoying it. Hey, It's a good game. They're all good games. Dark Souls 2 seemed a little mad based on everything that i played so far in it. I haven't finished it, and I haven't touched Sekiro yet. But that one, it's the one that I think I want to play the least, and I, I should at some point, but I'm also very intimidated by it because it relies so much on a parry system, and I'm not one for parries, so. Kind of bird? It was like a Stormhawk or something. Like King Stormhawk or, I don't know, something like that. Does this guy have anything new to say yet? It's been so long. That's a new body, isn't it? Is this a new body? I don't remember this one. There was a hype train going, apparently. I didn't even realize. Thank you for the hype train, guys. I asked you not to do sturdy, thankful of the no. hoodies and all the kick. Okay. So, it looks like everything is the same for now. 
Um, instead of upgrading there, I want to go visit a friend we haven't since we beat Radon. And I wonder if he has anything to say. E.G. Because uh, he was part of this whole quest line. There's the one I have now. It's a hawk. Did she say thank you for the dong? No. Hi. Ah, you finally come. Oh. Blythe told me everything. You've defeated General Radan, unlocking the stars. Stop. The general was blighted by Scarlet Rot and driven to madness. But not long ago, he was hailed as the mightiest demigod of them all. There is no parallel to your achievement. Nor to Lady Rani's acute judgment of character. Thanks to you, Lady Rani's fate once again stirs. And the path to Nokron has opened. Descend underground where the fallen star struck Limgrave. And make it yours. The precious treasure of Nokron. I'll make my way back there eventually. Uh, talk. Oh, Blythe wanted me to tell you. Isn't he in Nokron? Not to bother waiting for him. And head straight to Nokron. Blythe has been given an important task. Apparently, a matter of great urgency. Something more urgent than the. The f eternal city or whatever? You need not await, Blythe. Descend underground alone with a fallen star. Shut up, Mimsy! And make it yours. The precious treasure of Nokron. So that Lady Rani may tread the dark path of the Empyrean. What could he be po- What? What could he be doing? Weird. Uh, Alicia, thanks for grabbing a notebook. Finally, for some F merch, I have stationary addiction. Thank you for feeding it. I got you, girl. I haven't even got one for myself. God damn it. I will eventually. Thank you. I appreciate that. Hoping there could be an owl. An owl at Solash would be really, really cool, Belvin, for sure. You need not await. Descend underground and make it yours so that Lady Rani may trip. You need That's not it. Descend and, and make it yours. Where's so Where's Blythe? I thought he was already in Nokron. We were gonna meet him there, cause that's what he said after we beat Radon was, "Meet me where the star bit the earth," which is Nokron. Seems a little odd. I have a plus 20 halberd, baby. You ha if I sit, does he say anything else? That's an important task. I'm bothered. Greetings, my friend. You need not await, Blythe. Descend underground alone, where the fallen star struck Limgrave, and make it yours. The precious treasure of Nokron, so that Lady Rani. Maybe someone here can elaborate. Because Blythe literally said, meet me down there. But now there's an important... Mi uh, I'm... Mm, something's not adding up. I feel weird. Maybe Blythe's the bad guy all along. I think What's-Her-Face is still asleep. Something just seems strange. Also, never found that dragon here after he left. 
Still haven't come across that dragon. Are you still seeping? Yeah. I should be able to just take her hat off her head. I'm just saying. I should be allowed to do that. Just make it my hat. Why does she need the hat? She's sleeping. She doesn't need it. My hat. I am perplexed. I feel strange. Does Dick Face with the big hat know something? Soap. What's his name again? What's his actual name? S Saliva? Saluva? It started with an S. That's all I remember is that it starts with an S. Cerevis? Cephalus? Syphilis. Spaghetti. Hmm. I am bothered greatly. Keeps the light out of her eyes when she sleeps. I I guess that's a valid point. Celibus! What did you do to Blythe? Begging for another lesson so soon? Ugh, there remains much to be done. Make it quick. Nothing. He has nothing new to say. Where could he have gone? Because no cron started here. Could he be back at the ruins? Maybe, maybe he's at the ruins again? It just seems really, really weird to me. Maybe I'm looking too far into it. But it just seems very strange to me that he told me to meet me there, to meet him there. And then EG suddenly saying, oh, Blythe told me to tell you that not not to worry about meeting him there kind of thing. Like, did, did the EG, what did you do? Is EG suspicious? These the right ruins? Yeah. Don't see him up there. No, I don't think he's up there. I mean, we could try. No. I feel like maybe I'm just looking too far into it. Stormhill, Ever Jail. Where could he have gone?
I'm overthinking, aren't I? Is that the one where we first met Blythe? We fought that guy, he was saying, if you ever see him, it's like Deweed or David something. Is it that one? It is Rivlin? Maybe we should check there. I mean, it's somewhere we've seen him. We've seen him in the Mistwood Ruins. We've seen him there. We've seen him at the Three Sisters Towers, and he's not there. He's not at there. We checked Siofra before going to Nocron. He wasn't there. And we've seen him at Redmain? I checked after he left. Like, we talked to him at here after killing Radon, and then he left. That's when he said, "Meet me where the the star bit bit the bit the earth." And we were here after that, and everybody was gone, even the dude with the hat, with the the flamberge. And I think that's all the places we've seen Blythe. So. But I don't think we can go in here. Like, once we're done killing the boss in there, it's gone. Like, it's it's not lit up anymore. But maybe he's in the area? It's the only place we haven't looked. But that's... That's implying that he's just going to be somewhere we've already seen him. Which is... Like, the odds of that... But what other important matter could there be? Like, we, we've been trying so hard to get in the Nocron and we finally get there, but then he's not... ...gonna meet me there? That seems... ...not good. The wording on some of the quest stuff is a bit misleading. Misleading, what do you mean? Oh, I'm gonna one-shot you. Almost. Guys are annoying. Feels good to kill him, and so easily. Oh yeah, I don't have to worry about going through these waters. I dealt with the dragon. Yoink! Yeah, this is probably a waste of time, but you never know. Uh, I'm going the right way, I think. Where did I go? I went the complete wrong direction. Oh my god, I'm a moron. I was following the wrong marker. <laughs> Oopsie! What's up, Ginge? Oh, I went the wrong way! What number marker is it? It's two. It was the most recent marker I put down, so I thought it would be the highest number. There we go. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, see, these guys are still here, but they're not lit up after you kill the boss. Like, the circle part. No fucking way! Oops, that was master volume, my bad. I meant to do this for a second. Do that again! Where are you, bro? Okay. We're definitely hearing it. I 
don't see him anywhere, though. Should I go buy a lottery ticket? Sounds like he's off to my right. Should I try snapping? <laughs> Come on, man! I'll Jesus! I was literally- Please. I just snapped! I was- He's not answering. Thank you for the bits, you shithead. <laughs> Talk? Oh, it's you. He's down there! Bye. Old EG trapped me here. Told me I'd bring north but failed to Lady Rani. But there's no chance that could happen. I'm part of a bee. A very shadow. I thought old E.G. knew as much. Honestly. I don't know what's going on anymore. Oh! E.G. locked him in here? Is that what he said? I don't understand. Why would E.G. do this? I could never intend harm to Lady Rani. What was he thinking? I kind of want to see if EG says anything before I open it or leave it closed. Is this like the one ring situation where they're going mad and... Because they all want the prize, no crom, jewel, whatever it is down there, treasure. This is EG's way of getting it. Hold on, hold on. Before, before I do anything, first off, holy shit, he was there. What? EG? Buddy? Greetings, my friend. I probably have to open the door or something How first can I help? with Blythe. Oh, here we go. Why is Blythe in the Everjail? I presume you've spoken with Blythe? Yeah. Very well. There is something you should know. The two fingers gave Blythe to Lady Rani as a faithful follower. Her very shadow. Incapable of treachery. But if Lady Rani, as an Empyrean, resists being an instrument of the two fingers, the shadow will go mad. Transforming from a follower into a horrid curse. But such is his destiny. In such matters, Blythe's own thoughts hold no weight. It pains me so. But he must be neutralized. For Lady Rani's sake. Fuck. Something else? He has nothing else to say. So I guess if we further along her quest line, he'll go mad? Well shit, you didn't know this, Rublum? You didn't do this? He didn't say Blythe was a no crom. He said he had another. He said he had another matter to attend to. I know. He said that Blythe had another matter to attend to, but that was kind of a lie because that was E.G. kind of covering up the fact that he got locked away.
That's the reason I went looking for Blythe in the first place, too. It's because Blythe was supposed to meet us in Okram. Oh, you're explaining a problem. <sighs> yeah, technically no one says that Blythe is in Nokrom. But Blythe says, meet me there. So EG having a different story. And him being locked away is a way to protect Ronnie. Something. Hmm. <laughs> I want to look up the quest line so bad. I want to look it up so bad. Part of me wants to just let him out to see what happens. It's like, how do we know that EG's telling the truth, right? How, how can we... How can we know that? Oh, I see why you're confused, Roblem. Yeah, technically no one said that Blythe was in no crumb. Blythe was the only one that said, meet me where the star bit the, uh, bit the earth. That was the only person that said anything about Blythe going to Nokrom, which technically in a way is still just an assumption, but I mean, it's a literal meteor in the ground. That sounds like the star biting the earth. So do we let him out? Be wary of blood loss. That was the first boss. Maybe he'll still help me in Nocron, but he'll go mad but not be imprisoned. So what? We'll have to end up maybe fighting him, which will be sad. But I feel like... If that's- if that's the path he went with the two fingers to be her shadow, he knew of his potential destiny, right? So I feel like he would just wanna maybe- if that's the case, like, write out his destiny and say a fight happens and we defeat him, and that's him and his destiny, as opposed to this for the rest of his life? Like, that's- and especially if he goes mad, that's fucked up. I was searching all through Nocron for him. I was like, where the fuck? But then did what you did? Checked all the places I saw him before? Yeah. The second EG said something different. Um, I felt like there was something off for sure. I don't understand. I could never intend harm to Lady Rani. What was he thinking? I'm gonna open it. Maybe he'll fight me here. What was that? Oh my god, I thought I targeted him for a second, but it was the freaking anal beads behind him. <sighs> you stupid rocks. Hi, Blythe. You alright, man? My thanks, friend. I'm going to see Mr. Srani now. I don't know what came over old E.G., but even if the odds are slim, I need to check the mistress is safe. Now. Uh-oh. Rani can finally set in motion the fight against her fate she's dreamt of for so long. Oh, he's going to see Rani. What if he goes there and then E.G.'s like, what the fuck, and then they fight and he kills E.G. or E.G. kills him? Uh-oh. I'm going to see Mistress Rani now. I don't know what came over. Uh, oh. Oh, what have I done? Oh, what have I done? I dabbled in business that wasn't mine. Oh, I d uh oh. Did I fuck up? I might have fucked up. But Blythe is. He's still here. Are you gonna get mad at me? He Maybe he doesn't know. Well, my fellow, has war counselor? 
Ora's blacksmith. He has nothing new to say. Did I make a boo-boo? I don't know. Okay. He has said nothing. Maybe something changes when I go here. Oh no, what did I do? Look, he locked away Blythe. That's not cool because he's been a cool dude this whole time and I want a statue of him to have on my shelf. Uh, okay. I have killing everyone at the round. Shut up. It's an accident. If I do another long play of this in the future, I'm going to make sure that as many people survive as possible. Because, yeah, pretty much everyone around me has died. I have a question? Yeah, go ahead, ask away. I said that earlier, you never said anything, so, yeah. No Blythe? Did Celibus stop him? Oh boy. Um. He said he was going to see Ronnie. So. Where are you? They're just normal wolves out here. Advice for me starting, what the hell am I supposed to do? I got my shield for my confessor, like where do you go, etc. It's an open world game. Just explore. That's all. That's literally what I did. I just explored. Went to things that looked interesting to me. Just went on an adventure. I'm not even kidding. That's the whole point of an open world game is to just go wherever you want. Learn as you go, right? Give you hints on where to go? Kind of. For, like, storyline stuff, but... Exploring is a huge part of this game, so... Where is Blythe? Need to go? You just go where you feel? Basically. I'd say just keep exploring Limgrave. And, uh, and go from there. Cause like even now I'm in my 90s as far as level goes and I'm still going back to Limgrave and finding things. Begging for another letter. Blythe is in here, man. So what's going on? Did he not make it? Or is he still just here? Did he not leave yet? I don't, I'm so confused. Or maybe things don't press forward until I go through Nocron. Oh, you never found that Riblem? Well, there you go. That's what I get for being too curious. Yeah, he's gone. But he wasn't... And there's no prompt to talk, so he's not back in there. Huh. Did Blythe lie? Did he go somewhere else? Huh. Very strange, but... I don't know where to go from here. I could go underground. See if he ended up here anywhere.
Hmm. What if Blythe is lying? This is new to you? Ooh. Don't you just love it? You you play the game one way and then like how many streamers do you watch play this game after and then you just see how many things get done differently? It's It's insane. Wait a minute. Did I go to the wrong one? No. Maybe? Can I jump back up here? No, I went to the wrong. Wait. Nope. Let me up. Yeah. Never mind. We're good. Oh? Oh, what, Roblem? Why you oh? Now, according to the steps here, it's kind of like Siofra. Where are they? There's there's the steps leading up to one of the ancestral bodies again. I admittedly forget where they are. Um but like the pedestals need to be lit. I actually don't remember where it is. Back here. And there's one left that isn't lit. So my assumption is I have one more to find. You watch three different people play and it's all different? Mm-hmm. I keep see seeing people run into things I, I missed, which is so cool. Yeah, this. Hollowhorn grounds. So there's another one of those corpses. And then these pedestals. There's one more that needs to be lit. This one here. So, one would assume that I'm missing one of the little thingies out here to light. I don't think it's that one. I'm pretty sure I got that one. Yeah, the singing here is very pretty. Uh, maybe it's this way. We never did go this way. I've been denied horse. I guess we'll come back to Lendell. <laughs> the ADHD is strong today. Oh my. Night sacred ground. Interesting. That's literally, it looks like the same statue underground where we fought that boss. The dragon kin dude with the lightning. Nom Dad says hi. Hi, Nom Dad. Hua. Hope your Saturday's treating you well. Rejuvenating bullish. Eh, oh, Jesus. Bullishes. Statue that will not come alive, please. Hello. Silver tear? Hi. Can I help you? Oh. Okay. Uh. Runark, cool. Um, what time is it? It's been 4 hours. Okay. I'm going to hide here for a second. Chat, make sure I don't get murdered. I'm going to go use the bathroom really quickly. So I'll be a few minutes. And, uh, I guess we'll figure out what to do when I get back. So yeah, just make sure I don't die, okay?
Rublum? Is it time to ban you? Was that you with the fart? Am I banning you, Rublum? I'm gonna ban you! Swear to God. Oh! Oh, it was Hefe. Hefe! You almost got Rublum banned! <laughs> Thank you for the bits. Appreciate it. Alright. We're good. You're good. You're safe. Where am I going? I could go down there, maybe. Looks like something wants to kill me, though, and there's stuff over there. Should I... Should I go there first? Hmm. I'm running across building tops. Do, 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 do. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Ooh, hello, what's this? Celestial dew. Almost says duty. <laughs> Love? Love? You're weird. I love lamp. Hello? Seems awfully quiet around here. Wait. Is that thing gonna... Silver tear thing gonna shoot... Crossbows at, crossbow bolts at me again? First off, think carefully. Oh, I'm not good at that. Am I backstepping? Under what? Are you implying that you can go that way somehow? Nah, probably not. Not trusting that. No, sir. Let me go this way. Where'd that silver tear go? Fucking buttholes. Trifigures butthole! These damn notes. I need a t-shirt that says, try fingers, butthole. <laughs> uh, that, that'd be terrible out of context, so I probably not, but that'd be funny. Ah! Almost fell. Where'd the silver tear thing go? Oh, it was you. It was you. Sure. Ow. Poke. Poke. 